If you've been wanting to use Thrive Leads together with GoToWebinar, you're in luck because that is possible. And here's a quick tutorial that shows you exactly how to integrate the two. In your WordPress admin dashboard, go to the Thrive options here and you'll see the API connections option. And then from this drop down menu, from the connection type drop down, choose Go to Webinar. Here, all you need to do is enter your Go to Webinar email and password. So just the same credentials you use to log into your GoToWebinar account, that's what you enter in these fields. And then you submit that by clicking on the Connect to GoToWebinar button. After a few seconds, you should see this success message here, and then in your active connections, you will see GoToWebinar listed. Now, when you're editing your form, click on the opt-in element and click on Connect with Service. Create a new connection and select API, go to the next step, and then from this dropdown, select GoToWebinar, and this will bring back a list of all the currently scheduled webinars you have in your account. So this will just show you all of the webinars that are scheduled for the future because obviously it doesn't make sense to sign up someone for a webinar that's already happened. And you simply select the webinar you want to sign people up to and click on save. And then on this screen, you can determine which fields should be shown. Now you have to have an email field but you can also have an optional name field and phone number field and you can activate them or deactivate them with these checkboxes. You can change the labels in the fields. You can have inline validation and a few other options. And an important option is here. After this form is submitted, so after someone signs up through this opt-in form, you can choose to either reload the current page that they're on or redirect them to a custom thank you page URL. This is what you'll want to be doing in most cases. So you enter your thank you page URL right here and you click on save. This updates the fields and once you save the changes in your editor, that completes the connection and anyone who signs up through this form will be added to your GoToWebinar event. Now make sure to also test this. So publish this form somewhere and sign up with a test email just to make sure that the new lead is added to the correct event in GoToWebinar.